on semaglutide. I've done this before, but I'm, I'm going to say I'm a little closer to neutral on it now. Um, first, let me say, if you guys like um, fitness tips, uh, nutrition tips for older adults or beginners, people just starting out in the gym, subscribe to the channel. We do interviews with nutritionists, um, personal trainers, and doctors. Um, I'm not a doctor. I'm not a nutritionist. I'm none of that. I'm just a health club owner that has been experimenting on myself and staying healthy since I was a teenager. So um, that's kind of what the channel is about. Now, semaglutide, if you watch the channel, you know I'm a big fan of peptides. And all semaglutide is, uh, Ozampic is a, another term for it, uh, it's a prescribed drug, is a peptide. And, you know, I, I've just heard a lot of bad, bad things about it. Now, your body can make peptides. All a peptide is, is a, a short chain of amino acids, which you get from your diet, and then your body takes the protein apart. That's where the amino acids come from. Uh, it, your body takes the protein apart, and then it puts it back together. It puts those amino acids back together. So protein uh, is made up of amino acids. Your body takes it apart. Now you have singular free form amino acids. Your body takes those amino acids and puts them into new chains depending on what it needs. They make enzymes. They do a lot of things. So I'm a fan of peptides, but um, insulin is a peptide. I'm just, I'm just not 100% comfortable with it. I've heard so many things about it. And here's, here's the main reason I'm not comfortable with it for me. I'm not telling you not to do it. Uh, the, Invigor Medical. I'm I'm affiliated with Invigor Medical. Medical. You can get it there. Go look at it and, and other peptides. Anything you get at Invigor Medical, use the promo code Vitality One, and you'll get ten dollars off whatever you buy. So, I'm affiliated with Invigor, who has this product, but I don't like it because it's probably not going to solve the problem. If you're overweight, a lot of people are taking it for weight loss. And I've talked to people using this um, semaglutide or this peptide, and they say, look, my appetite just went away. I feel good. But it's doing something that your body is not choosing to do. And that's what I don't like about it. And if you're having weight issues, you need to look at what the real issue is. What is the root of the problem? Do you have a hormone problems, a thyroid problem, gut problems? Are you eating the wrong food? Why are you gaining weight? Especially if you're eating a, a fairly healthy diet and you're exercising and you still can't get weight off. Something's wrong. So yes, taking something like semaglutide works for a lot of the people that I've talked to. Um, and here's, here's the deal or the reason why I'm coming kind of back to neutral. The dose has to be very, very small. So, um, one of the nurse practitioners that I've talked to and a couple of the people I've talked to, to they say that the key is to taking a very small dose. This is something where more is not better. More, more does not work better. More works worse and can probably mess you up. So that's where I've kind of come back to neutral. If the dose is very, very small and you try it for a month or two, maybe. I'll say I'm almost neutral on it. Um, I'm still not saying this is the first thing that you should try. You should try to figure out what's wrong with your body, your hormones, and do, do some tests. Talk to a good nutritionist or a good maybe functional uh, physician who can help you figure out why you're having an issue losing weight before you jump right to this. So anyway, that's my kind of new take on semaglutide. Um, I'm still not going to say it's the first thing you should try. And it's something I'll probably never do. But anyway, that's my new 
two cents on it. Um, thanks for listening, everyone, and we will uh, see you next time. Thank you.